Welcome to the OrthoView video tutorials to begin where to start. There are two main inputs to the OrthoView software. One is images and the other is templates. If we start with images they can be acquired via the in basket which will be discussed in detail in another video tutorial or will be launched directly into OrthoView if you are using an integrated system within your packs. To acquire templates, log in to the internet site myorthoview.com and register for an account. How to register for an account is detailed here in this document. Once registered, log in with your username and password and submit. When logged in, there is further information on how to create and update your template library presentation on version 5 to version 6 changes plus access to the tutorials you're currently viewing and training guides. The key pages of interest will be my templates where your template list previously selected is stored and request templates to acquire new templates. Once the template selection for the site is installed and your images are available to you, you can start the active part of the AuthoView session. The context sensitive help menu will be available throughout to assist you with the session. When no longer required it can be closed and hidden to one side. Whether launching from the examination list, the double click or open, or from the examination panel, you can now move through the OrthoView workflow stages. In this pre-prepared OrthoView session, we see the various stages available to us in most typical procedures, to begin with scaling, where a calibration device is used to calculate the magnification of the image. The next tab is planning, where wizards and tools exist to assist you with making measurements and calculations for particular procedures selected. The reduction panel is presented in trauma procedures and allows segments of bone to be realigned. The templating panel which will be available for most elective procedures is the final stage and allows positioning and sizing of the template. The OrthoView session can then be saved or committed to an archival file of choice. This ends the tutorial on getting started with OrthoView. Please view the individual panel tutorials for more details on their function.